Challenge, social distancing. Place monkeys such that they don't overlap the the tower range. Yo, y'all need to get freaking better grammar. Okay, I'm sorry, but like, wow. Okay, I'm joking, I'm joking, but I am in fact down to do this challenge, but social distancing? Didn't COVID happen like four years ago at this point? Okay, I'm done, I'm done. All right, let's get it. It looks like our opponent's gonna be using the best hero in the game, Cyber Quincy. Obviously kidding. We instead are gonna be using my man, Benjamin, with the strategy, Darling NG Spike Factory. I know, it looks bad. But to be completely honest, guys, I couldn't think of anything else, so... I guess we're just gonna have to work with this. Now, you might think, well, Boltrace, technically the Darling Gunner, it's a little bit cheap, okay, to use that for this challenge. And you might be right. But the thing is, bro, like, I cannot think of another tower or strategy, I'm sorry, that I can use with this challenge. This challenge, when you really, really think about it, is actually extremely hard. And I'll give you an example. Let's say that we wanted to go with a buffing tower, like the Alchemist. Well, that's out of the picture because the Alchemist can only buff towers that are in the range of the Alchemist itself. So we quite literally cannot go for that. By the way, let's go for Benjamin all the way up here. Okay, I, I thought we did not get him before the start of round two right there, or round three, I'm sorry. But we did, in fact. I'm gonna have to go for the powerful darts upgrade on this Dartling Gunner as well here. Okay, that's a lot of blues. Let's go for that. Beautiful. Now, if we leak some lives here, by the way, not a big deal. Because remember, with having Benjamin within our strategy, he can not only make us money, but also regenerate our lives. Okay, so you might also think that running with Benjamin is cheating. But, bro, like, again, like, I don't know what else to run with. Because if I go with a hero, then I'm super, super limited to where I can place my remaining towers. So that's kind of why... I wanted to go with Benjamin, so I can just set him off in the corner somewhere very, very far away, where it doesn't take up a lot of actual good spots. You might think it's a loophole, man, but again, like, try this challenge out for yourself, and then get back to me, because I have been struggling with this challenge, man, with, like, what towers to use, just, like, overall successfully completing the challenge. Like, it has been just a rough, rough journey, but hopefully... This is finally the game that we do, in fact, need. I did go for the faster barrel spin, by the way, on this Dartling Gunner. That's a lot of Grinch Greens, boys. Oh my god, this, this guy's eco is insane right now. It's because he has very, very cheap towers on the map currently that are super, super effective early on. There's no way that my Dartling Gunner cannot fully defend this. What in the world? He's still sending Grinch Greens. Oh my goodness, man. Okay, I'm probably going to have to go with another attack. Or not attack. A Dartling Gunner. He has Sniper. Okay, so his Sniper and Tax Shooter are social distancing, but not Cyber Quincy. He, he wants to get up all in that Tax Shooter's grill. Okay, that was cringe. All right, but let's go with another Darling Gunner, like I said, all the way down here. Okay, so, so far, technically, all of our towers are being social distance. Let's use that level 3 ability. Now, the level 3 ability, there's going to be a 2-second cooldown on, though. And that 2 seconds is a very, very long time. Uh, We're good, though? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We might leak a few more lives here and there, but it's all good. Back to Space Blacks here on round eight. Beautiful. Okay, we're making this work. But yeah, these Darling Gunners, they're literally on opposite sides of the map, although they're technically shooting at each other. So, I don't know. I hope that's not <laughs> against the challenge rules, man. And the, the way that the guy explained the challenge was kind of weird to me. So, for example, if I go with an NG or a Spike Factory, okay, right here, I'd have to say that I can go with the Spike Factory where it's like outside the range, like its circle is outside the range of another tower. So like, I can't go with the spike factory right here, but I can go with the spike factory right here. But like the way, oh, oh my God. I didn't, I didn't mean to set that down. Okay, I, oh my God, bro. <laughs> I was trying to, to, to find a good example, man. But anyway, look, this gray circle is just outside, or Benjamin is just outside of the gray circle here. But when we click on Benjamin, their circles overlap, but bro, I'm not, no, I'm not doing that. I can't see both of their circles at the same time, so it's going to be harder to line up towers. We're just going to worry about whatever tower we're placing down, their circle, and that is it, making sure that there are no other towers inside their own circle, okay? But round 12 is here, spaced freaking rainbows it is. I guess I should go with Hydrocopods. Beautiful, got that up. He decided to go with the bottom pad sniper. Now, that sniper is extremely OP. So we're just going to let him be. Did you just send me rainbows there? What? I mean, we're fine. Yeah, we're, we're full chilling against that. 
Um, but I think maybe I want to utilize the uh, balloon trap on the NG. I mean, why not, right? And the thing with the NG, the reason why I picked it was because it is a tower that has a buffable upgrade, but we can buff towers from anywhere on the map with the overclock. Like, you don't have to have the tower inside the range of the overclock. You get what I'm saying? So, that is going to be extremely nice for us. I guess I can sell this spike factory into a balloon trap here because, again, that was on accident, bro. It truly, truly was. But this engineer is being social distance as well. So, so far, every single tower, it's like every tower is like kind of like in the corner for us. The four corners, if you think about it. So, that's pretty cool. But... I might cross path this with the top path, by the way, which will spawn in some sentry guns. And then those sentry guns have range of their own. We're, we're not worried about the sentry guns range. Okay, that's just going to make everything more complicated, which this challenge is already complicated, bro. There's like a lot of like technicals, I feel like, with this challenge. But we're not worried about those, okay? He does have the spike factory, by the way. So tack sniper spike factory. Yeah, like I don't see that being very good. But you know what? We'll let it slide. I'm trying to go decently late. But like I was just talking about, look, look, they have their own range. I'm not worried about that, bro. Okay, wait. We're good here. We are good. Yo, Ben, why didn't you hack those down for us, though? That's actually crazy, Ben. Okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. Trust, trust, trust. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, I can't go for a cleansing foam for this balloon trap because the cleansing foam definitely would overlap. So I guess we just cannot do that. I'm going to transition into Pink Eagle as well here too. Let's collect you. And I would like to send Zebra Eco on round 19 here. So yeah, let's try to do that. Now, if he sends us a fortified Moab though, we got to watch out for that. But at the moment, he's full on Ecoing with Black Balloons. He's going to use that level 3 ability. Although this sniper is goaded... Now the AI is a little bit tougher to defend against, okay? So he definitely has to watch out here. Okay, he's in a tower boost. With the tower boost, he should be fine. Oh, did I eat up all of his spikes? I actually did not. Okay, are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Yeah, I should go for a banana farmer, right? Probably. Oh my god, wait. He's literally about to die. He needs Quincy level 10. Oh, I guess he's just dead, bro. Uh, okay, you, you could have Maelstrom. What? Whatever. All right, round 12 here in the next game. Let's get this in the young men. Space Rainbows. They're definitely using one of the strategies of all time, by the way. But we're just going to let them be, okay? We're looking to go late game with this one. Oops, didn't saw out the round right there, but that's okay, bro. Over 1,000 eek over round 13 is definitely extremely solid, okay? So I'm going to try to saw out this round as much as I can, but at the same time, we're, we're going to go for a balloon trap as well. All the way down here, just like we did in the last game. And, bro, like... I guess that last game, like, I wasn't even trying to kill him. I swear, that wasn't a rush. I was simply ecoing. So, if my opponent just dies to my eco balloons, then I guess going late game just wasn't meant to be. But yeah, like, maybe it's not smart for me to go for a balloon trap like this early on, because then I'm really not slowing out the rounds at all. I'm going to be popping most of these AI balloons literally immediately, because those AI balloons are getting eaten up immediately by the balloon trap. So, I don't know if that's a throw or not, but, uh... Can my opponent do something, by the way? I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, but we got the four corners once again. We can't get, like, directly in the corners, but you know what I mean, okay? Uh, he's got heli. Okay, bro. Ninja Alk heli is a good strategy. It is. But um, I don't know if this guy has the right idea necessarily. Like, he does and he doesn't. I don't know, man. Okay, wait. One red balloon got through right there. Let's go. Let's all this round as much as we can, baby. As much as we can, baby. <laughs> We're going to transition into Pink Eco. Bro, like, look at how much more money we have this time around, though. That's pretty crazy, all right? But, um, I guess, like, I mean, we could go with the top path upgrades. Watch this, though. Wait. With the range on that, actually, I can't go for... Where should I go for a banana farmer, then? Mm, maybe, like, over here, then. Because the banana farmer... I didn't even show you guys in the last game. I was trying to go for it, but... If you look super, super closely... It does have a small gray circle. So, I think right here technically is allowed because, yeah, no circles overlapping or no towers overlapping. I'm sorry. Round 18 here. Uh, I guess, yeah, we'll cross path you with the top path. Are you going to, like, do anything, bro? 
Like, what's going on with this game? Let's just clear this obstacle then. Why not? I guess at least he went for a rubber to gold. So, like, he's making money in that way. But I don't know, bro. He's probably going to die to my Zebra Eco, right? Like, I have to send Zebras here, too. I literally do. Let's see, though. Because he doesn't even have a stronger sim. But Churchill's pretty OP. Okay, I could be I could be wrong about this. Because, like, low-key, he is shreddy. But the AI is going to start. Okay, yep. Level 3 there. Four stat. That's good. Like, dude, did you just, like, forget that you, like, you actually need to send balloons, my friend? Uh, trying to stall out the round, by the way. Okay, let's just pop all these balloons. Good, good, good. Well, I guess at least he's fine. Okay, he's going for heli farm. Bro, his eco is, like, so bad, though. Okay, whatever. Round 20's here. Benjamin hacked that down for us. Appreciate you, Ben. Because he kind of sold me in the first game. So there would be no children balloons, a.k.a. no ceramics or anything underneath that mob so that's why i'm kind of kind of trying to stall out this round here all right pop that finally bro our eco is crazy this game oh my goodness bro dude this is the power of stalling though look at this stalling out the round so much here bro oh my god <laughs> literally almost have 4k eco for round freaking 22 that is just absurd i'm gonna send him a zomg here I'm also going to use my level 10 ability right about now. In case he would have sent me a ZOMG. Okay. He's got to worry about that. I mean, I think he can defend. But, uh, like, since nothing's happening right now, I just decided to send him one of those. Okay, so where are we thinking our defenses should be? We could go for technically right here. This could be a super mines. Thoughts? I kind of like that. So, yeah, super mines right here. Carpet of spikes then up here. More towards like the center of the map. Yeah, I'm liking that. And then where can we go for our overclock though? Can we go for an overclock right here? I'm going to check. So right now with the base uh, range, we're fine. But yeah, we get that increase of a range. Uh, I think I think we can't. Unless we, we could sell the balloon trap to replace it with an overclock. I'm kind of down for that. But yeah, every tower is currently being social distant. Uh, did he go... For okay, so he went for a Moab shove. I mean, that's one way... Okay, wait. Level 10, though. Sticky bombs, too. He's got... He's, he's got a tower boost, I was gonna say. Uh, I still think he's dead to the insides. Oh, no, bro. I wanted to go lake in, but, like, nothing was happening, man. He's just dead. I'll, I'll try to stop sending balloons just to make it a little easier. Oh, it's so many insides. I think he's dead, isn't he? No. Oh. 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 Okay. Um, you know what? <laughs> I, I straight up did stop eagling because I, I wanted to continue on this game. <laughs> it definitely did not look like he defended, but whatever. All right, Benjamin hacked down that Moab again. Appreciate you, Benjamin. So, again, this will be my carpet of spikes. Kind of a weirder spot, but it's, like, more directly in the center. I'm thinking, like, right here, super mines, since they can initially... Hit like fortified BADs and stuff, and then after two, they come around the bend once again. They can be hit, so that's why I'm thinking that will be pretty good for us. So I guess we can just start going for that now. Just start going for you now as well, because we could easily go for the carpet of spikes, for example. 5,000 eco, by the way. I feel like that is more than enough. We're just gonna stop there and just prepare our defenses. Then wait, if we're ecoing or if we're stopping with the eco this early on, we might actually be able to pull off then. Uh, this ultra boost so if we could ultra boost our towers with this challenge bro that would actually be insane okay so we're, we're gonna give it a shot here we do have to be cautious though of round 28 ddt's if he sends those we go for carpet of spikes and we should be chilling see the problem with his strategy is that like he doesn't know how to use the ninjas properly he's just going for a ton of balloon jitsus that's not the way to go you gotta go for one balloon jitsu okay wait i think we're fine against that without even yeah look at that <laughs> yes, sir, baby. Yes, sir, baby. Okay, that that got me thinking, though, that he's going to send us DDTs here. So I don't necessarily want to go for the Ultra Boost just yet. Okay, but we are good. But yeah, you got to go for the Shinobi. So you only really want one Balloon Jitsu to upgrade that to the Grand Master. And then one Sticky Bomb to upgrade that to the Master Bomber. But then after... Especially with the Alchemist. Then you can go for more Balloon Jutsus inside the range of the Alchemist to get those buffed. Uh, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah, like, he's just spamming Balloon Jutsus, no Shinobis. So, like, those Balloon Jutsus 
even with the Alk buff, they're pretty darn weak, okay? But Ultra Boost here, thoughts? Oh, I don't know, boys. Okay, okay, wait. Maybe, though, maybe we should be Ultra Oh, wait, shoot, I have to tell you. I'm so sorry. So sorry about that. Because they didn't social distance enough, the balloon trap just died. No, nah, but I actually forgot to sell that. Okay, it wasn't up for that long, though. Wait. Okay, I'm going for Carpet of Spikes here, and I'm Ultra Boosting this first. Okay? Because, like, the, the Carpet of Spikes is obtainable right now. Um, if we need to go for another tower, we could right here, it's looking like. So, oh, wait. Like, right there. Ah, that's, like, right on the line, though. Okay, more down here, then. Like, right here. I'm just going to have this Spike Factory kind of, like, on standby in case we need to go for something. Okay, B BFB, are you kidding? Are you kidding me, bro? B BFB, bro, no, no, B, no, 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 no. I know they both start with B, but it's B-A-D, not B-F-B. I know that's confusing, but no, no, no. You you have the right idea, I think. I want to believe that you, that you have the right idea, my friend, but oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, wait, shoot. Okay, for the, so for this range, I had to sell this. Okay, good thing that we didn't upgrade this then. Okay. Oh, shoot. Can I go for another spike battery then? Aw. I don't know. Maybe up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here I can. Like, right about there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's good. That's good. All right. Already ultra boosted the times for. Bro, he's going to die to the AI before it can even defend anything, bro. Come on, man. I really wanted to defend against something. I mean, we clearly have the life advantage. He's literally sending me purples. Oh my goodness, bro. Like, you you actually, guys, like, bro, like, dude, no, like, sometimes, though, like, I go against decent players in BFB. I swear to you. Bro, wait, okay, bro just leaked a Fortify mod, but whatever. It's fine. But, like, I swear, God, and then he's gonna use level 10 randomly. Wait, what? Okay, it must be, like, extremely laggy. Let's go for the super mines here, I guess. Bro, like... It, it doesn't make sense to me, though. It truly does. Yeah, I just go for more Balloon Jitsus. Assassin. Okay, let me spam the Come At Me emote. Maybe that's what I should have been doing. Okay, you gotta have a Tower Boost or something, bro. Uh. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he thumbs us up. Please rush me. B-A-D, bro. B-A-D, brother. There's, there's actually no way. Okay, just sold something. Please tell me you're gonna rush me. With at least one. Yes! At least one. Watch how fast we shred this. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> no freaking way. It's not even ultra boosted to the max. Okay, let's ultra boost you. Let's ta tower boost as well. Spike storm. All of this. Why not? Bro, look at that. Look at that, bro. The fact that we pulled this off, I just wanted to do all that because he's dead to AI. He's dead at this BFB right here. Uh, is he gonna is he gonna try again bro ultra boosted both the super mines and the carpet of spikes social distancing all of our towers he's gonna tower boost here but I, i'm pretty sure he he's just dead to ai bfbs like i don't know i guess i'll ultra boost you now even though it doesn't matter mad yes sir baby yeah that that's gotta be death right okay bro like bro i don't i don't know anymore man I think I have to rank up to the Hall of Masters at this point. Like, no, nah, like, this is crazy, bro. How are you guys making it to BFB? Hey, at least we did successfully complete today's challenge. That is what matters. So GG's. And if you haven't already, make sure to check out this video where this noob made the biggest mistake. See ya.